Well, hello everyone, welcome back to the Oceanic DLC game. We started in this continent and now we conquered another one. And we need to get more territories into this city, so we have to maybe um, detach this one. But there is a hostile army apparently, so we have to do something about them. Oh, those are actual ships, by the way, I need to be careful. Although they are gods. And uh, my ships are obviously uh, better and stronger, so that is something to consider. Let's do these, and maybe that, and maybe this. Actually, I think I'm just going to upgrade the whole navy. These guys are going back home, I think, so that's fine. And uh, yeah, this guy's still at war with me. Oh no. They, we, we made peace with the Swiss, that's true, uh, at the end of the previous video, so basically they uh, declared war on me very early in the game and I was here and there was a whole other culture here, so for centuries we were at war without any combat, which was silly, until I eventually won the war and got paid some money that I'm now using to improve my navy. So um, our next target is of course the leader of the game, so the leader of the game is by a lot, actually. Agamemnon uh, and he, he was obviously the leader because he had the largest continent we can see here this continent goes from very up north all the way down here and then you also have a few small islands around it so uh, pretty good stuff another couple of islands here and then you can very quickly through those islands get to this other continent where they got this uh, little piece of land and now they are destroying uh, my my ally here, Mama Oklo, and so yeah, they're being conquered as you can see here, and that's going to be very bad. Hopefully, they they go to war against uh, this guy here. He's he's uh, Gilgamesh. He's been very annoying too the whole game. So it would be great if they fought against each other. In my case, I have to assemble a huge fleet, take this city, and then from there go all the way to Susa. I think. Um, but I need to assemble something really big if I'm going to attack that guy because he's the leader of the game. Problem is, if I don't attack him, um, I don't think I can catch up. I mean, maybe, maybe in the contemporary era with all of the projects, the space projects and so on, I can catch up. But it should be a lot easier and a lot safer to catch up by attacking the leader. That's usually the best way to do it. So we will have to create a huge army. We are going to get, uh, where are they, the Hawaiians, um, they have a nice emblematic unit and a ton of food with these and also more influence per workers, so pretty good stuff in terms of influence as well. We have 12 era stars, we want to get one more here and I think that's it, I could try to get another diplomat era star but I don't think it's going to happen. I think it's mostly going to be the scientists that are stars because another technology is already coming. So I only need a few more turns to get another one and that should do it. Okay, so this guy... Oh, we got alchemy, that's nice. But this spy can come here and get all of the... Yeah, all of this stuff, all of the leverage. And here we get yet another boat. This time you are merely a bystander to someone else's glory. Okay, that's fine though. Uh, listen, my navy needs to come to this side of the world, so they will. Uh, these fellas, I think they pretty much also just have to leave this continent. I'm not planning on fighting the Swiss again. Sovereign, how can I help? Can I do this? I have a proposition. Nope, for they you. refused. I think you'll like it. And why would I accept this proposal? I will it would be best. get some leverage from this one and then we'll see. I think Here I we have some treaties. Remember that. Can we do this? I no, it's been refused apparently. Okay. I think you'll like That's it. not great. I need this alliance to continue. I really, really do. Okay, so we're going to get a navy there. I'm thinking of a man of war and a sloop and a couple of carracks, something like that. Political entitlement. Okay, so we are going to go with the Republic, I think. Although, I mean, this could be nice. I just lose a ton of science, so I don't want to do that. 
How far so I'm going to go the with the Strength of the Militia, is which is far from family. ideal, but uh, I really can't afford to lose that amount of science. It would be insane. Okay, so these guys, we have so much leverage around there. Do I have another envoy or something around here? Another spy or whatever? We have leverage right there. Okay, maybe here instead. Let's go with another unit to get it because there's so much of it. And these three guys, yeah, everybody's going to come to this side of the map. These guys are also coming here. Okay, it has been a while, but I'm not at war with anyone anymore. Oh, these guys have disappeared, of course. I was thinking about keeping this city and or letting them keep this city. And um, yeah, that's good. Let's balance this a little bit. Um, and and keep them as my vassal with this city here, but. Uh, I didn't have enough points to do that, so I couldn't. Okay, let's go here. Mm. Three food, that's fine. This is 12 food, so let's do this one first, actually. And uh, let's, yeah, let's buy it. That's good. You go there, that's fine. These guys, uh, they should go here, I think. Um, these fellas this is leverage so I cannot grab it with these guys clearly what is this guy can he grab leverage I don't remember if these guys can actually grab leverage but he will try for sure these are some nice units that can go and help with the attack You can build units here, so uh, can I still build the Caribbean pirates? Uh, I don't have I don't have money for the buccaneers, unfortunately. I think I should get another spy and send him into that land to see what's going on there. You can do this. Totally fine. And cultural wonder. And this guy will go My there. considered opinion. Oh, look at that. One of your competitors. Garnered a lot of fame building. Okay, so that someone else build a wonder. I'm totally okay with that. I don't really care. One more turn for this, and then we go. Yeah, with another star. Uh, we can consolidate the third place. We are moving up. And then uh, we will go into the industrial era. Okay, let's go here. Let's go there. It's still very far, of course, from enough to actually get any of those diplomat stars but at least we ha have something for for some Come, for relax. some actions Let us speak what if i do this it will not be international crisis vote how about that i'm going to go international crisis i'm going to support myself obviously all those of honest intent may and then uh, let's Give see me your gold now this guy this guy is so annoying have man. You no shame? yeah have you no shame I will refuse There's this just no way to make this work obviously I do not accept um what else is happening Whatever here Whatever you must say say it quickly nothing's happening Okay, we are pending the boat here. Let's see what happens with that. I just want to annoy this guy a little bit. Get more people to hate him, maybe. He's attacking with musketeers already. Whoa. Musketeers are at the end of the... Well, the Janissaries are pretty much just a strong, but the Janissaries are at the beginning of the early modern, whereas the musketeers are at the end, so... He's doing really well in science. It's going to be really, really tough uh, to catch up with him. Let's go with the industry here. And then... Um, then, I don't really know. This is plus 10, plus 2 industry, plus 2 industry. That's nothing. Let's get more industry over here, maybe. 
then maybe this guy is for some money okay and we'll continue moving in this direction you guys go here as well all right then okay we have the mobile typeface which is pretty good another era star and now we are definitely going into the industrial this we are first to industrial era so that's something i guess let's get the hawaiians uh agrarian is pretty good because i have a lot of food so it should be easy to get those stars and let's see how strong these guys are 48 even when defending against close combat bonus, bonus combat strength against damaged targets that's not a bad thing to have so yeah, let's go for it. We're going to go for more production, I think. Um, yeah, this is fine, actually. Artistic expression. Free arts are fine, but I, I know I'm not in a rush, actually, for any of the things. I'm going to let it go for now. Hail, sovereign. Another crisis, okay, whatever. So what happened with the Congress stuff? Three more turns. Okay, they are they are losing by a lot. Okay, they will have to pay me apparently. If they don't want to declare war or something like that, which I don't think they do. Okay, so this continent is going to be further away from the war. So let's do this stuff, you know, let's do more production. Yeah. All of those things are nice. Let's do the production first, actually. So the harbor can be done a little bit earlier. Uh, charter companies for the money is going to be good. Siege cannons. Probably better, actually. Because we are going to a big war. Um, okay, what is this? One Karak. Okay. I'm going to start attacking those guys, but I need the rest of my units to reach me. Okay, you go here, that's totally fine, let's go. Perfect, leverage intel, now let's go there. These guys will uh, come across here, maybe. These fellas will go... Mm, okay, let's go there, I think that's fine. This guy just got some nice intel. Uh, I think he can get some more of that. Um, let's see. Oh man, so many enemies over here. Let's see here. That's that's a safe spot for an envoy because the blue guys are my allies, so it's all fine. Okay, we have a man of war. That's good. Uh, this dude. Mm, there is no more leverage there to be grabbed. So. Uh, if this guy, if uh, Agamemnon brings spice, he's going to be in this territory, I think, first. So we're going to be around here with this guy, just trying to detect them. You go there, that's fine. Now this fella... Try to grab uh, this stuff, maybe? I think that's fine. That's try to make something useful with those guys because espionage really is not very good in this game like siphon district and so on that's not super good you get detected very quickly then they attack you and it's kind of a okay so the actions here with, with the agrarian stuff i cannot do them because you know all of my borders are with my own cities well, i mean i can do them but i won't get so much out of them um instead when I conquer, I can start doing them. That should be fine, actually. Let's go here first. Let's do this. This guy will wait. This guy goes here, getting more intel. We have the Hawaiians. We need a lot of um, population, but we already have one of these and one of those from the previous war, so that's pretty good, actually. Now, Kagura, you can spawn the units here. I guess that's fine. More access. I, I do want the access. Access to um, stuff like like iron and so on. 
Okay, I do have a lot of influence per turn, so I don't need actually to pick the one that allows me um, to... Oh no, this is the normal one. This is industrial production. I was confused with uh, communal land, which I already grabbed before. Um, this one, more farmers, more traders. Uh, more farmers, I think. National control of vital products and resources. Also, how about the wonders? Could provide more freedom and autonomy. How much do I need here? Oh, 10k. That's a lot. I should not have grabbed the the civic. I need a lot of influence for that. Uh, the the late game wonders are actually pretty good in this game. So, yeah, you have to keep an eye on that. Okay, another navy with a big guy. All of the navies should have one of the big guys, the capital ships. Um, let's go, no, here maybe, yeah, that's fine. These guys will go here. These guys will go all the way here. Okay, apparently they go faster by sailing than using the roads. Yeah, this is still okay. Republic evolution. Uh, democratic Republic gives me more science and money and common quarters. I cannot use that though, I, I have to wait. Are these guys? Okay, they are still the Ottomans. We greet you, as always, with a smile. They keep refusing propositions, that's annoying me a little bit, to be honest. Uh, plus three money per instance in all cities. Okay, let's do this one to get a little bit more money. And I could go for a little bit more gold, but it's a bit more expensive, so I won't do it. Um, yeah, okay, that's this is fine. We are starting to prepare for that big, big war, but you, you cannot rush it, really. That's the thing about that. You cannot rush that, that type of combat. Okay, this dude... Um, I'm already sending one guy there. I think this guy is actually going to go to war. Yeah. Okay, another boat. Another boat. We have a nice navy there. These guys are just going to wait for now. And here I can keep annoying this guy. So what happened with the boat? Okay, I'm still winning. It's been supported actually. Uh, I won the vote and he accepted the demands and now he's going to pay me. Okay, that's that's good. I will vote here for mercenary armies. So, wow, 51% to 49, that's close. Anyway. I hope I win that because I really want those mercenary armies. This is 47 foot, that's insane. That is absolutely insane that's a lot of money a lot of food sorry 53 here i mean come on that's super crazy irreligion is mostly useless let's wait for the wonder here that's the main thing we want to get this guy absolutely wants to keep doing that uh, stuff he's already doing okay let's go there siege cannons okay Impressive. A cultural wonder. Okay, that apparently makes I discovered yet another cultural wonder. Mounted warfare. Supply lines could be interesting. Okay, let's see. Industrial era, what do we want? Uh, I do want my unique unit, which is this one. Line formation, let's go. Flintlock, Carbine, yeah, that's all very good. And then we are going to go propeller, probably. A cultural wonder. In my considered opinion, okay, let's see. One of your competitors Can I poach a, a trade route? No hostile trade routes? Seriously? If I say all, there is a trade route here that is not hostile, apparently. I don't know why it's not considered hostile. Let's go and take a look. I don't know what's going on with that. It's not so easy to understand which trade routes the game considers hostile, right? Like. In this case, everyone except for my allies should be hostile, and I have only one ally, so to see you, friend. this really shouldn't be so complicated. No doubt, this independent. You have 
My attention. Okay, they lost their, their embassy, so I cannot do agreements. Not only are they the vassal and who are they? of, of Agamemnon, but they also they lost that. Okay, I would so really me. love you today? to stop being enemies this with this guy, be but there is just no way. Even if it's not yours. Press freedom. Any yeah, this one is good, actually. Is Let's oh, I forgot about the savings for the wonder. Okay, whatever. It was still one that I was going to get eventually. High alert. Overproductive looks nice actually. It's better to be overproductive in this particular context. Okay, someone attacked me by surprise, yeah. And then they left. Okay, let's go there. You can buy this. That's a ton of food. Mm -hmm. More copper, that's pretty good. 18 science with this, let's do it. Okay, and then these guys. They're going to get the food because we need it. We need, we need. Wait, what? There's a fight where? Oh, retreat, what are you talking about? Okay, that was that was something. Ah, the ambush mechanics in this game, such a bad implementation. They make no sense the way they are right now. So yeah, it is what it is. Let's go here. Let's go here. And now we have another couple of navies. That's not too bad. This guy wants to go and take a look at how things are going there. No, this one is going to stay here. He's not a spy, actually. This guy is a spy. They are the British. 12 turns for me to get revealed. Okay, let's not do that right now. 15 market court. Who knew there was such Did anyone ever tell you how ugly you are? I want to refuse this. I'm 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 just way way too strong to be concerned about his demands. Okay, so this city is starting to be nice here. And we're in a good navy. The thing is they don't have anything down here, so I could take it quickly. So nice to hear from you. Okay, I can wait for the demands on that. This guy just waits and does nothing. Everybody moves. This boat uh, joins the navy. Okay, this guy waits a little bit. Wait, what? I can poach, but it doesn't say any resources that I'm actually poaching, so I don't know what's going on with that. I don't know what I'm, am I stealing, actually. It feels a little bit weird. Anyway, let's keep getting a ton of food. And here, I think I'm going to go with a ton of food as well. Yeah, I mean, 60, that's insane. 44 here, also pretty good. One pilot will get at least one of those, 33, okay, I like it. And here we will spawn um, at least a uh, couple of buccaneers, maybe. Let's go with that. I will keep an eye on the city. I mean, I should be able to take it quickly with this, with this maybe. It's right there in the coast, so not much to do. Let's go here. We're going to start upgrading those guys very soon, actually. My navies are coming, so everything is starting to get ready. Aha, uh -huh, aha. Uh -huh. She ended we the cultural exchange to... treaty. Uh, I don't know what's her problem. Mm. Uh, she suddenly started position. hating me I for whatever right. reason. <laughs> She's my only ally. Does she have more allies? No, she doesn't have more allies. She's at war with a couple of dudes. 
So why doesn't she want all of the possible treaties in the universe with me? Like you're at war with two guys right now. God damn. Make recompense or no. I find your proposition outlandish at best. The reasons are not your concern, my demand. This proposition should be in all our best. Interest. I'll do this. I offer you just. Let's go international crisis vote. And then let's go here and support myself. And let's see what happens. Here in Marupapu. I believe land units is going to be here. I do need a couple of mortars. That would be nice to have. These cities could get take care of the peaceful stuff like science, for example. I don't see any leverage. Um, <laughs> apparently I cannot grab any leverage here. That's annoying. What is this? Some dude by, by this lady. Okay, let's go here. And now... Go down here, okay. I can start poaching stuff maybe from the harbor. No, because yeah, they will see me. Infrastructure, okay. Now let's siphon something here, like gold, for example. Great swordsman, absolutely not. We are getting flint luck though, so I could upgrade people to musketeers very soon. Let's wait for that. Oh, there's nothing here anymore. Well, that's a shame. Let's go back up there. Mm -hmm. And here... Oh, I guess I can siphon this. At least for a couple of turns. There you go. Good stuff. There should be leverage here, but apparently they took it all. Well, alright then, let's go and grab this one, if possible. Okay, you can go here. These dudes are coming here, yeah, that's all cool, all, cool, all fine. Let's wait for the musketeers, and this fella... Oh, he's going for the leverage, okay, that's fine. Now, here in Kauka, mm, we, we absolutely want more units, yeah. Uh, this is 55 science, though. Okay, you know what? These guys are going to be building the units. Mm -hmm, this is fine. Let's another couple of Karaks, because you can never have too many units in this game. I am paying quite a lot of money though, but that could be fixed. Oh, look at this. Uh, plus 20 industry on harbor. I do have a lot of harbors. Uh, minus 50% heal action cost on naval unit. That's perfect. And cheaper naval unit cost. That's also perfect. This is a new wonder. I mentioned that in the test. Uh, it's not super amazing for me right now, so I'm not going to go for it. This game is um, hard enough as it is. This is money and science, so it's... I mean, the Statue of Liberty could be great, but I think I'm going to go for this one first. Yeah, that's just how it is. And you go here, and then, let's see, you can upgrade. You can upgrade. This guy can upgrade, this guy can upgrade, he won't upgrade maybe just, just yet. Another one of those guys can upgrade. Okay, that's like an army. These guys go here. Greetings. To what do I owe this pleasure? Or refuses. I'm sorry, but no deal is better than a Okay, that's perfect. What happened with the vault? 
50-50. Oh, so tight. Okay, um, we do want this. Okay, maybe there is fine. This guy goes here. What do we have here? Okay, they are bringing some units. Uh, which is uh, sketchy, to say the least. Hmm. I think I need to keep an eye on these guys. They are coming for me. They are not at war with anyone else. So, yeah. Let's go, baby. It's time for war. Okay. Uh, these guys will move around, try to use the roads a little bit. Uh, yeah, I cannot have archers at this point in the game anymore. So this should be fine. I still have chariots though, I should I should do something about that. Mm -hmm. Let these guys wait. Let's finish the turn and see what happens with these navies. Yep, they are coming. And they do not have open borders, but they are imperialistic, so they don't care. Um, they are in my land, though, or in my um, territory, so I can totally attack them. Let's go and do it. You go here. Can I go and attack this guy again? Right, what's the idea here? What do you have? This is all land units, so if I attack them like this and the, the navy cannot help them, they are very dead. Okay, let's do this. You can buy my forgiveness with gifts or with blood. Refuse. Just no way to make this demand all. So only chaos. Move toward light. Another vote. Let's go. Second vote. Support me. And if they want to declare war, they they can do it. That's fine. I'm, I've been actually preparing for it, so we are okay with that situation. This guy are just waiting. At this point, okay, someone took that influence apparently, some that leverage, not influence. You know what I mean, the leverage that these guys keep trying to grab. And it's not so easy. Okay, these guys wait, and then, um, hmm, good stuff, let's go. Some cannons to invade, that's pretty good stuff, obviously. This guy be better wait. Uh, inland because it's a lot safer. Uh, you're going to do this a little bit faster. Thank you. 14 turns was fine. Uh, no, I'm not going to spawn any boats here. That's silly. Okay. Mm, I think yeah, Maru Papa will do one more mortar. Compared to this 20 territory, Birmo, most other cities should be referred to as neighborhoods. What is this? Oh, that is a proper navy, and this. This is also a proper navy, actually. Let's go. Okay, let's do this. Kill this guy, kill that guy, kill this guy. Kill that guy. Okay, we killed all of the land units in one go. I could stop one of the navies from spawning. Yes, I can. Let's go and do it then. Even this outdated dude can actually participate, but yeah, not doing much apparently. Let's do this, let's go here. And kill those guys. And so we have three here and then seven dudes there. And then these guys, okay. Let's go, let's move. Alright, so that's fine. Let's wait for these reinforcements to appear because those ones cannot do it. So he's playing, he's bringing some stuff. Aha, uh -huh, you still have some land units here. Oh, these guys are wounded? Oh, that's very good. 
Okay. They try to attack the big ship. Which is, of course, not going to work for them. Yep, that's totally fine by me. He's bringing all of the boats really close so I can really destroy them. Let's go for this. Let's go for this and that, I think. Yeah, that works. We go here. Mm -hmm. I didn't need to kill uh, a land unit at that point, I, I just like it when I can so easily kill units in just one attack, it's awesome. Let's go here and do that. Uh, the main ship is stronger, but honestly I don't know if it's worth the price. I'm, I'm kind of still doubtful about that. It's a new system of course, I need to play a bit more. But um, I need to see how the big ships are at, uh, attacking cities. They should be really much better at attacking cities than the escort ships. So um, that's the whole point of building them, I think, according to the new system. And uh, yeah, we are, we are going to check that out for sure. But first, let's kill more Karaks. This guy is still holding here. And around, yeah. How many guys do you have alive? Three. Okay, so there is one more that I'm not seeing here. Oh, he just got attacked by the main ship for no reason, apparently. They didn't move it. Okay, I would really love to find that hidden unit. Because this guy has to leave, right? So I could go there and let them bring a whole new navy and then attack that whole new navy. After all, I am stronger than them. But I don't know where the prowler is. I'm, I'm kind of confused about that. Okay, they might actually get to kill one of my guys. Okay, but they are taking damage, so that's not so bad. Okay, now they're going for the big guy, and the big guy is tanking a lot, so... Okay, cool. So what is this? Okay, this is not the kind of guys that I want to use there. We got another Era Star, so that's good. Mm. No. Let's get out of there instead. Okay. Let's start trying to hide. Okay, let's get out of that territory. Uh, this guy will go here, I think. This fella is waiting. You're waiting. These guys are approaching the action, I think. Okay. I am going to need money. As you can see, my armies are so huge that I'm starting to uh, lose a relevant amount of gold per turn. Anyway, they lost a ton of war support from that battle. So that is quite perfect, actually. An agrarian and a star, that's great. Let's go here and start doing damage, yeah? You go here, attack that guy. You go up there, attack this guy. You go here, oh wait, I didn't. Okay, now I did. You go here, attack that guy. You approach, you go back. You go back because you don't want to get wounded. So where is the prowler? We have no idea. Well, that's not a lot of fun, I should say. I don't know what's going to happen with that unit. Uh, how can I finish the, the combat, you know, if I don't find it? I have no idea how that will work. They're trying to retreat. It's not going to go well for them.
Okay, let's go here. Oh, wait. I, I made a mistake there. Okay, that's fine, though. Let's go here. Let's go there. Some friendly units around. That's good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Let's go with this. Let's go with the big guy and attack. Uh, let's say that fella. Yeah, and now he's dead. And now you go here and you kill this guy. And that's all good, but where is the... This guy, the prowler. Where is he? Okay, maybe up here? Oh, look at that, I found him, finally. He was hiding in the sea. You know, a land unit hiding at sea. How does he do it? I don't know, but he does. <laughs> Seriously, though, that's, that's, that doesn't make any sense. Anyway, here we go. Big ship, kill small ship. We got a star, we kill a bunch of units. Now the land units are coming to defend that, which makes sense, obviously. Now all of these guys need to heal. I don't have the money for it, apparently. So that's bad. Okay, so these guys are um, C units. But I need to declare war to attack them there. It's always so excruciating to hear from you. Okay. Uh, how's this vote here? I am winning, apparently. Um, yeah, I will declare war anyway, but it's nice to have destroyed a bunch of his units all of a sudden. He should still be stronger than me. Oh no, now the strength is comparable. So that went well. And uh, yeah, we are now going to heal all those votes. And then we'll go to his land. Okay, let's go maybe here. And then we'll go to Constantini, Concrete, and all of that stuff. So we are starting to get really ready for this war. Uh, so we are going to see all about the big war between me and the game's leader in the next video. Until then, please remember to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and thank you very much for watching.